I crafted 20 of these packs and was it worth it? Now, I want to see one walkout, okay? I think I, I think I have a right to say that. Starting off with Yappy Yappy Zeus. That is not the worst start. I do have his ones to watch though. Now, we could do with some serious players such as any league or or Bundesliga player just a link with my red card so my team looks hard. Black Ademos. As always, I hope you are keeping all well. As I used to say, mainly in 21, I will be showing all of these just so I can show you who I get in every single pack. That way, it is a proper test and it's not just showing the highlights of the best ones because mate a lot of people probably fall into that trap of opening upgrades after seeing the you know the top five walk out to Stegen that is decent I didn't even really see the walk animation mate um I can't see him walk out anywhere but to Stegen's really good that is a really nice pull by the way for like our third fourth pack in he also links with it Musalera but right, I peeled them for the uh, little swinging in I don't know if it did it then though I really can't tell uh it's not Kato Navas is it oh my god that's Kalo Navas. Oh, cheeky. Mate, back to backers. Um, they're both keepers and they're untradeable. But apparently Navas is really crap. So now we've got two absolute broken options for keeper. All right, all right, all right sweet. So yeah, that, I mean, I'm looking forward to using that card. That's not too bad. Literally, we're only five in and we get two keepers. Is this going to be... No, no, it's not. Um, it's going to be a board. Uh, Luis Alberto. To be fair, I had so many rares that just chuck in untradeable duplicate. It was it was quite satisfying because you need no chemistry as well. So they are really quick and easy to craft. At the end of the day, like have a little pop of these packs even if you are a little bit stingy on like on your own club right we are pushing halfway through open now um uh, not of it. i don't even want to touch on the um for hero pack um mistake the other day that is by far one of the biggest ever mistakes they've made and also i swear they're like they promised people who pre-ordered the game the ultimate edition a free for hero pack if i might thinking i might be completely wrong on that but something along the lines of that we're in buying the ultimate edition and they released it essentially for free the other day by accident. So good luck getting yourselves out of that one. I would hate to be here right now. I don't know. They probably will just sliver out of it. It's not a burk. Burk? Oh my god. Portugal, Centimid, Ruben Nivis, Son, Zala, you know. That's all we that's all we ever want, really. Let's not lie. Um Hummels is still going strong. Come on, we need someone very big for the team. Bane. Bane's just never good now, is it? I, I mean Spain hasn't been a good nation for the past like five years, you could argue. You could argue. Anyway, moving on. Mores, that's not too bad. That's actually not too bad at all. I've got Anthony though, and Anthony's playing really well. Can I play him on like Cam or something? Because if so. Oh, no, you can't. It's only one position, isn't it? I mean, that's a really good card. If I could play that cam, that would be, like, ideal. But, for, like, you know, without a doubt, he's going to be a super sub. Come on, baby. Hodgeberg. Yes, Hodgeberg. As a whole, these haven't been too bad. Three walkouts from 20. They're really cheap to do. They're, like, 2 3 k probably from scratch. Like, every 10, you should be getting a walkout. Um, if not, then your value is just kind of gone. And even then, you could still pack players such as, say, Maximum, Anthony Rashford. Anyway, last one. Thank you very much for watching. Rate these out 10 in the comments if you have opened them. Uh, ending it on... I'll probably do more of these as well. Uh, Columbia. Um, Iturbe? Iturbe? Uh, Uribe. Yes, until next time. Take care. And uh, yes, in a bit.